Savor the moments and you will learn to cherish. That was the essence of Cindy's speech. Ladies and gentlemen, what are the three points that we can learn from Cindy's speech today? Number one, I love the fact that she interacted with us as audience. Do you remember how she interacted? She asked us, do you feel hungry? Do you feel thirsty? And all of us say, yes. Perhaps the food is not enough. Right? So that interaction shows what? It shows that she's trying to break the ice. She's trying to connect with us. And I find that to be brilliant. Second part, I love the fact that she used humor. Notice she asked, she said, look at me. I'm well endowed. And every one of you smile. Humor break the ice. Humor shows that the speaker is shielding confidence. Because only confident people can have the capacity to incorporate humor into their speech. So I love that. Finally, I love the fact that she used great language to paint pictures in the minds of the audience with her words. For example, she said, the car squashed like a recycled can. And we can immediately visualize that. So I love that about you, Cindy. Very well done. And these are the three points that were impeccable. How can we elevate them to be incredible? So here are the three points. Number one, consider giving specific call to action. Why? Because you're a speaker here, the audience want to take away something from you, something very specific. You have considered saying things like this. Savor the moment with your family. Savor the moment with your friends. Most importantly, savor the moment with yourself. For time is limited. When you have that strong call to action, your audience will feel that, yes, from today onwards, I'm going to take heed of your advice, I'm going to savor the moment. So that's one point that you can actually consider looking at. The second point you can consider is showcasing your result. You can say something like, after I learned the concept of savoring the moment, I started to wake up every day, looking forward towards the day, and I, every day when I reach home, I get to go to bed feeling relaxed and eager, looking forward to the next day. I feel better, I feel stronger, I feel more inspiring. That's the result. When you have the result, you elevate your credibility as a speaker. Finally, consider intensifying the pain. You can say something like this, as the bus was moving up, and I look out the window, I realized I was a centimeter away from life and death. That's why I know. I realized that I need to savor the moment. I need to cherish the present. When you intensify the pain, the audience will be able to relish your epiphany and your result. So Cindy, your interaction, your humor, your language were impeccable. Consider specific call to action, results, and intensify your pain to make it incredible. Keep speaking, and you'll be nothing short of formidable. Back to you, fantastic.